Hello and welcome to Access DNR. It feels like spring has come early and we've taken full advantage of the favorable weather. This month we get sneaky with golden eagles, take to the seas with sonar, get fired up about land management, and more. I'm Anna Lucenti Hoffman, bringing you the latest and greatest from the Maryland Department of Natural Resources. Our first story takes us to Washington County, where wildlife biologists are studying golden eagles. As part of our annual survey, hidden trail cameras are strategically placed near deer carcasses, which serve to attract migrating eagles. Pictures captured by the cameras are then used to identify individual animals and provide information on the overall population. Across the state at the Old Bohemia Wildlife Management Area in Cecil County, Staff are working on a very different kind of project, a prescribed burn. This process is carried out by expert staff and only during ideal conditions. It's a very efficient way to remove dead plant litter and promote the growth of native vegetation. Such efforts benefit ground nesting birds by creating more suitable and sustainable habitat. In other news, staff from the Maryland Geological Survey traveled to Southern Calvert County and hopped aboard the research vessel Karen to evaluate the progress of a newly created artificial reef. To conduct the survey, the crew deploys a series of sophisticated sonar devices that capture and return imagery of the sea floor. The data collected will later be analyzed to assure that the placement of reef materials met department standards and specifications. Next up, we traveled to Kent Island to pay homage to a third generation Queen Anne's County waterman for his commitment to the conservation and restoration of the Chesapeake Bay. On his 91st birthday, Captain Eldridge Meredith was commissioned as the 101st Admiral of the Chesapeake Bay. During the event, remarks were made by Secretary Mark Belton, Lieutenant Governor Boyd Rutherford, and others. Congratulations, Captain, or should I say Admiral, Looking forward, we invite you to make history with us. March 11th marks the grand opening of the brand new Harriet Tubman Underground Railroad State Park and Visitor Center located in Dorchester County. Contractors are working hard to put on the finishing touches, installing exhibits, hanging graphics and more. A full weekend's worth of activities are planned to commemorate the park's opening and its celebrated namesake. We hope to see you there. Well, that's it for this month. For the latest events, programs, or news, please be sure to follow us on Facebook and Twitter, subscribe to our magazine and newsletter, and download our free award-winning mobile app. I'm Anna Lucenti Hoffman. Thanks for joining us. We'll see you next month.